Where are you, Danny Phantom? <clears throat> Danny's not the only hunter you gotta worry about. Stop where you are. Uh, are there Danny? Yeah, I don't have time for this. Eat Ethure, loser. Yeah, I'm not above bullying this Danny. Have it your way. Huh? What the? Did we crash a frat house or something? <laughs> What's going on? You don't ask questions. I'm in control. Uh, now, where is he? Danny! That's right. I'm back and better than ever. Now leave my city alone. Finally. With your home under attack, it was only a matter of time before you arrived. Phantom. I don't want to fight you. I'm giving you the choice to stand down. Choice? No, this is a matter of destiny. I'll have my bright future. In this dimension or another. We can talk this out. This is your home too, Phantom. Or should I say, Danny? You forget. I'm more than that now. Time out! Yeah! Too easy. Then let's make it harder, shall we? Daniel? Glad. You couldn't stop meddling even for a second, could you? Danny! Whoa. Thanks for the accessories. No problem. Sorry your little detour took so long. Clockwork's lair was a mess. At least his time medallions should cancel out Phantom's time powers. Now we can kick some butt in style. I'll give you credit. Always pressuring me to join you. Always scheming to unite. <laughs> it paid off. Your procedure, your ghost half, it's given me enormous power. What? I made you? Surprise! Ah! Oh, stop! That was a different me! Oh, come off it. This is what you always wanted, Vlad! Ultimate! Power! Ah! Ah! What in the... Vladdy! Back for re-election? Jack, uh... we hate him, remember? Right, right. Mind if I crash this little college reunion? I do, actually. <laughs> no! My Fenton Bluetooth! Oh, still has cup holders, though. Ah! Time out! Time in! Doctor! Sam! Now! Huh? No more! What was that? Phantom must not be fully merged. He's expending energy to keep Clockwork in line. So, the more we hit him, the less energy he'll have to keep himself together. Yes, but... Copy that. Be careful. It looks like reality gets more unstable with each blow he takes. Got it. Then I guess we'll have to make this quick. The foundation's unsteady. Then let's bring it down. Did it work? <laughs> no. Enough of this. Sam? Tucker? Jazz? They're alive. For now. You trick with the time medallions. <laughs> but it wasn't enough! You two destroyed my life. So don't think for a, for a second that I'll let you have yours. Don't you see this is crazy? Reality is dissolving because of you! If you keep this up, we'll all be doomed! If that's what it takes to eliminate you, then so be it! If every ghost is a manifestation of emotion, why would you... die for power? Why are you so... angry? When will you learn? I've long since transcended your human weakness! You're wrong! You're also my phantom. Which means you're full of emotion. Full of fear. I fear nothing! Uh, 
Why amass all this power for control? Why control others so no one else leaves? All I ever wanted was love, but my quest for power drove everyone away. Maddie, Jack, even young Daniel. I thought turning back time would fix my mistakes, but it only made things worse. I still hadn't faced the fundamental problem. Me. It was always me. I'm going to change that. I'm going to make amends. That is my purpose. Starting now! Are you all right? Good enough to finish this. Together then. On three. One, two, three! Don't do it. Send that monster back where he belongs! No, I can't. I won't. I trapped him before, and look what happened. It just feels... To lose to you, of all people! You just don't get it, do you? This was supposed to be my chance! My happy ending! All I do is lose! I lost this battle, my timeline, my... my... Family? Why did I lose everything, and you didn't? I, I don't know. I'm sorry. I didn't do that, I swear! No, he did. He's been outside the time stream too long. His structural integrity has been compromised. Which means? He's falling apart. No, no, no! I'm going to lose my body now, too? Yes. Unless we find a way to anchor you here. Maybe the thermos is the solution after all. No! No! Ah, I'm not going back! I don't want to be alone again. You won't be. Vlad, what are you doing? The right thing. For once. Huh? I've lost everything in this world too. And by my own hand, no. We may be of different timelines, but we are kindred spirits. I volunteer my body. It's not much, but it'll keep you here for now. This... this has to be a trap. It's an apology. A second chance. I... I accept! <laughs> Vlad! Of all the probabilities... incredible. We must work quickly before they split. I will get them to a secure location. Wait! Vlad, I hate you. But... thank you. I'll be back. Danny! You did it! That's why he's the GOAT! Way to go, dude! Way to get your powers back! Thanks. I'm just glad everyone's alright. Clockwork, are you okay? I am now, thanks to all of you. Who would have thought the embodiment of time would have needed saving from a bunch of kids? Humbling indeed. I am so very proud of you. Thanks. We couldn't have done it without Vlad, though. Yeah. Did not see that one coming. Ten out of ten plot twist. I wasn't expecting it. But I guess ghosts are still like the people they were. They're... complicated. Speaking of complicated, how on earth are we gonna fix all this? Ah. Yes, yeah, about that. I'll need to take these back. Time out! I'm afraid Phantom has caused substantial damage to multiple time streams. Be aware that some changes may be permanent. I'll do my best to fix things, but it will take time. No pun intended. Like building a dam to level off waters. I'll have to compress some time streams to stabilize reality. What does that mean for us? Well, since you did save reality again, how about I give you a choice? What would you like? Is it too much to ask for things to go back the way they were? Not necessarily, but there will be costs. I can compress what's left of these corrupted time streams into about two stable timelines. In door one, everything will be reverted as it was but you will no longer have your powers. 
In door two, everything will be reverted as it was, but you will be erased from the disasteroid event. Your fame will be gone. So, my secret identity would be a secret again? To everyone but you all, yes. The choice is yours, Denny. Hmm, not gonna lie. Being accepted by my city after all this time has been amazing. But if anyone's gonna unite the ghost zone and the human realm, it's gotta be me. The new me. Even if it makes me the pariah again. And who might the new you be? I'm Danny Phantom, protector of humans and ghosts. I'll keep my powers and use them to be the bridge between worlds. Well put, Danny. Good luck. We're back! Yes! Do you think it worked? Out of the way, losers! <sighs> hey! Oh, it worked. Well, looks like we're back to being invisible. Ooh. Yes! Goths do a lot better being counterculture and all anyway. Guys! Shh! The mayor is speaking! First of all, I'd like to thank the people of Amity Park for re-electing me as mayor. Clearly, after the events surrounding the disaster raid, Mr. Masters was not up to the job. We'll never know how we narrowly avoided doom, but what we do know is this. Ghosts were responsible for everything. Oh no. And this is why, as of now, I am declaring Amity Park a ghost-free city. We will now have an official branch of ghost hunters, as well as mandatory anti-ghost training in all public schools. If that scoundrel Danny Phantom ever shows his face again, We'll be ready. Looks like this timeline is a lot less friendly to Danny Phantom than before. Yeah, now you're a ghost helper in a city of ghost hunters. You sure you still want to bridge worlds and all that? We've saved the world. We can do this. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. A second chance. And look at the wonders you worked. Let's hope you continue to take advantage of this. <laughs> Responsibility now. With the mending this time stream needs, I will not be able to help again if something goes wrong. But you have all the power in the world. Even my powers are finite. Maybe it's the fusion, or the time stream being in stitches. But something feels off. I feel weaker. Whatever the cause, know this. Your future is now entirely in your hands. I guess you were right all this time, Jazz. Mm hmm? How do you mean? About the psychology stuff. We found the source, and it turns out all ghosts are just manifestations of human emotions. Oh my gosh! For real? I'm gonna freak! Looks like you've got a new thesis. I don't know what's better! Danny making the anthropological breakthrough of the century? Or me being right? Eee! You have to tell me everything, right? No! How about we tell you over a nasty burger? I'm starving. Beware! Hold on, second thought. Let's get that to go. Already ordering. Got you covered, Danny. Do your thing. I'm going ghost! You gotta focus on yourself, on your faith, on your dreams, on your mind, on your health, yeah. You gotta work, never tell, keep your head down, find what you love and excel, yeah. Push and pull and repel any hate, go create what you want, feel compelled, yeah. And once you finally get a taste of the race, you'll never look back once you felt that. Don't let somebody take your time and your worth. Just focus on yourself, but.